Okay, um, I want to go a little bit deeper into uh, when I was talking to you guys about remember keeping your foremost in your thought processes that these entities that you're running across are in partial amnesia and they're playing a game. Um, the reason why this is so important that especially you star seeds as you get to uh, as the vibration raises your amnesia is going to start to drop away and you're going to be able to see things clearer and if you don't keep in your for the forefront of your mind that all of these entities are playing games uh, that they're impartial amnesia and they're playing games you're going to get uh, you're going to be tempted to be afraid or angry and that's why I wanted to bring this up is I do not want you guys to get to guys get sidetracked into fear or anger okay whenever I was talking about we're being watched this was a very new uh, energy it was a very powerful energy it is absolutely tied to a certain um, civilization and I didn't expect that our little group would trigger that particular machine that they use to draw their attention they are uh, it is a, a very unique vibration it is a very powerful energy and if you're not they are very um, involved in a lot of AI use so if you're not prepared for it it would be easy for you to feel that and be overwhelmed or afraid so the reason why I did those videos is number one I want you to keep in mind that all of the beings that are on fourth dimension even though when you start seeing them and interacting with them you're going to feel like um, there is no way that you can hold a candle to them it's going to they're going to have a lot of technologies that are going to overwhelm you from a human perspective 3d human perspective so I need you to just keep repeating they're playing a game they're in partial amnesia secondly you are a creator god nobody can trump that I don't care what kind of machine they've got I don't care what kind of collect collective they've got I don't care how big the energy is no one can trump your ability to control everything as a creator god nobody can trump that as long as you believe it keep it in the forefront then let them play their games notice them and go on by because there I think this is the beginning of a lot of energies whether or not you see the entities or not uh, I don't know that'll depend upon you but if you don't see them for all you empaths but you feel them expect to feel a whole bunch of new really big really, really unique overwhelming energies that are connected to these other civilizations you're going to probably feel them before anybody sees and is able to interact with them yet so I just want you to keep in mind that it's simply all this other energy that's available these other things that are going on in the fourth dimension if you're a starseed and you move into 5d wave wish them well on their path have them uh, in tell them to enjoy their ride but it has nothing to do with you and there's nothing they can do to get to you so relax don't want you angry or fearful because your creator God you trump everything and it's that simple really it is that simple and then if you will always look at them you can do that with the fear factor uh -huh, fear factor that your creator God you trump everything once you understand that and believe it you trump everything nothing can be done against your will once you truly understand incorporate that thought the second thing is you're gonna get you're gonna to want to get angry and in order to answer that vibration that is where I want you to just keep reminding yourself they're in amnesia playing a game so any of these other energies since that video I have uh, seen three or four more now uh, different civilizations different energy bands but I suspect that you guys are going to start feeling those too. They will feel huge. They will feel overwhelming. But that's all it is. It just means that you're now in fourth dimension. You're reading energies that are, you're reading them on a fourth dimensional level, which is intergalactic, multi universe, and multidimensional. So it's going to feel a lot bigger. And they're going to feel a lot stronger. 
So you need to just continue to repeat, Creator God, no problem, wave, bye. Secondly, they're having their games too. Don't get angry, don't judge. Um, let them enjoy their game and move on by, okay? Those are the two things, which is why I, I wanted you to get happier and happier, get out of fear, really believe you're the Creator God, because in this stage right here, as you zoom through fourth dimension, uh, there's going to be a lot going on. And as an empath, you will be able to read a lot of that. The higher you go, the easier it is for you to read them too. So not only will you read things that are going on here, but everywhere else in the fourth dimension too. So just keep in mind, that's why I said those things. We triggered uh, one civilization. That's kind of triggered a domino effect, which I knew was going to happen that you're going to feel other energies as well. Um, you do not need to lock in on them. You don't need to judge them. You just understand that that's a part of the fourth dimensional play that they're involved in. Okay? So, this is key here. Happier and happier. If you start to get fearful, plug in, I'm a creator God. Got this? If you start to get angry, you can plug in, it's just a game. Okay? And that's how you're going to deal with those, uh, the, the fear and the anger energies, which are really way far outside of your normal range right now. But if you lock onto them, it's going to drag you right back down. You're going to have to claw yourself back up again. So try not to do that. A, anything under right now, we're at 7.67 7 seconds, and that will change, of creation. So if you focus on something for more than... Uh, seven seconds, you're going to be drawing more energy like that. So as you as your vibration rises, that gap between um, intent and manifestation is going to get shorter and shorter and shorter and shorter to the point where you get to 5D and it's instant manifestation. So you're going to see that drop as we move. So it's imperative that you get a handle on this so you can identify it very quickly and change it very quickly. There is no time for allowing yourself to vent or deal or uh, if you're in my group here, it is not a time for shadow work. It is not a time for going back in your life and clearing up past events. Uh, at this point in the game, you, you, you will deal with those by saying, Everything happened the way it was supposed to. I am here for a reason. Everything's going beautifully. Resolve all that. Move forward. Uh, right? My my daughter says, what is that? She says, uh, the past is history. The future is a mystery. Today is a gift. That's why they call it the present. I love that. So try to keep that one in your mind. I love that. Okay, guys, uh, hopefully that clarifies those couple of videos. I will continue to keep you encouraged. To me right now, I am just feeling better and better and better. Uh, I can feel the higher bubbly rainbow, butterflies, bubbles, um, fast-paced, higher vibrations very, very close. I can peek up to them very easily now. So uh, I want you to be there too. Uh, don't think too much. It's past time for thinking. As you can tell, if we're at six seconds bef between intent and creation, you do not have time to think this out, guys. You have to do it with your instinct. You must move forward with instinct. So practice more and more instinct. Don't question yourself. Go with your instinct. You don't have to do this out loud. No one needs to know what you're doing um, because they'll think you're nuts. So just don't uh, just don't bring that kind of judgment onto yourself from others either. Uh, we have quite a little group going here. Great little bunch of people. And uh, so you've got plenty of people you can talk to in comments. Nye Collective, G-Man, Jeremy, Seth, the, uh, oh, just list after list after list of people that you can interact with so you won't feel alone. And uh, we'll just keep on doing this like this. All right. Hopefully that gives you a little bit of extra clarification uh, regarding those vibrations as they move in. I'm not going to identify each and every one of them that comes in because they're going to come wicked fast. And these are civilizations, uh, universes, multiverses, galaxies that are 
huge and they've been around for billions of years guys billions of years so they're going to feel very tight organized powerful but again it's just a part of the game and you are a creator god you've created all of this and more much much more with a thought you're a powerful creator god no worries okay no anger no fear no judgment let's play all righty then Love you guys so much. Huge hugs, and I'll talk to you later. Bye.